So good evening, good evening, good evening. We are back again. It means more FC versus Atalanta. And uh, it means more FC. I've just cocked that up. Uh, Darwin Noodles uh, probably should have scored. We are back again, guys. Hopefully you're all having a wonderful evening. Uh, hopefully life is treating you well. Is this even live? Are we live? What's going on with this control room? Is anyone here? What's happening, guys? Why is this not saying I'm live? Are we live? It's telling me I've got zero people watching. Zero people watching, apparently. Stream. Oh, there we go. It's caught up. Happy days. Big up to everyone locked in. We are here. I've just learned the difference between a cottage pie and a shepherd's pie. Uh, I thought I'd made a shepherd's pie. I didn't. I'd made a cottage pie. Who knew? Who actually knew? Yo, Atalanta are in. Oh, my days. How have you missed, bruv? Wow. That should have been 1-0. That should have been 1-0 Atalanta. Wow. Smacked Kelleher in the head. Please put our proper team name. Nah, man. It means more FC, bruv. It means more FC. It means more, innit? Trent said it. It means more, guys. I'll just share this on the community. Big up to everyone locked in, man. Smash these um, smash these likes up. Uh, I have no idea who took the shot. I don't know any of their players. <laughs> I'm not going to pretend I'm a hipster and watch out of Atlanta because I don't. All right, Darwin is romping into the box. So this is going out for a goal kick. Oh, the keeper saved it. The keeper saved it, guys. All right, let's share that. Okay. I don't even know what cottage pie nor a shepherd's pie is. Well, neither do I, apparently. Neither do I. Elite stream with Johnny. Come on. We landed it for nearly three hours. Liverpool in the box. Cut back. Ballooned over the bar from McAllister. Expected claps have gone up from Jürgen straight away. How's he missed that? Got a score, mate. Changed the... Change it to Liverpool. <laughs> was at the game on Tuesday. Caught some Germans. The Germans sitting in front of us. Proper scrap. Felt like the 1940s. I can't lie. Was you in the the West Stand? Because I see a scrap going. There was some old boy standing there. Shit his pants. Like proper. Felt sorry for him, man. And some little old man standing next to the Z German who was getting punched up by everyone. Yo, big up to everyone locked in, though. Side's calling me out, is he? For what? FIFA. And said you ain't on his level. This guy, bruv. This guy. Got you on here and West Ham game on the radio. Come on, off red. My guy. Big up. Ruby, Ruby, Ruby. Do, 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 do. <laughs> means more FC. Yeah, come on, bruv. Trent told us it means more, innit? Trophies mean more. Big up my sweetheart Galen as well. Tell him, girl. Tell him. Smash the like button, yo, di puta. This game started lively. Could have had three goals already. Two for Liverpool, one for um, Atlanta. Uh, 
and um, Ashley Cole's um, off-key looking brother, Gakpo, <laughs> has uh, won a free kick. He's on the ball again. Nice ball out to Simicas. Some dead cross goal kick. Arsenal sells Saka. Depends who for. Depends who for, mate. Shepherd's pie is made with minced lamb and mashed spuds. On top with herbs, cottage pie is similar, but with minced beef. That's what I did, beef. I did a cottage pie. It kind of makes sense that a shepherd's pie has lamb in it. That kind of makes sense. That's probably why it's called a shepherd's pie, lads. I never knew. Clock end was the main fighting, was it? You know, big up to George as well. Beef or beef. Oh dear. You see the Ashburton army? I didn't I don't I don't see anything, mate. I don't see anything. I didn't see it, guys. I'm way too busy and way couldn't give a shit if I'm honest. I barely see anything. That's why you guys always go, Oh, have you seen this? And I'm like, no, I didn't see it, bro. <laughs> I've uh, I've had a wonderful afternoon. Did the stream with Northside and uh, Flawless. Said was moving house so he couldn't make it. His, deliver, uh, his removal guy let him down, so he turned up late so he couldn't make the show. And he's got the audacity, the audacity to call me out for FIFA. Yeah, you are nothing. You're a fool. Good night. <laughs> Big up, Said. <laughs> Big up to Said. Good evening, sassy blonde. Well, you actually a sassy blonde, though, real talk. Uh, what does sassy really mean? Like, why don't you talk to me? <laughs> sassy blonde. Go on, girl. Bosh. Free kick from Liverpool is now in the goalkeeper's hands. Cottage pie all day long. I love I love it. Actually, I've always thought it was a shepherd's pie that I was cooking. It weren't. It was a cottage pie. Movies, cottage pie will take the skin off of the roof of your mouth. She makes it spicy. No, no, I love all of that. Put the fire out with a red wine. I can't drink red wine. No, 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 no. I can't drink red, man. It smells like vinegar. Yeah. Yeah. Not for me, mate. Not the pie. I love the pie. Pause. Um, <laughs> yeah, the red wine. Nah, 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 no, 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 mass. Shepherd's pie is on a sheep. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? It kind of makes sense. It kind of makes sense, isn't it? <laughs> Lee and Johnny dropping elite ball knowledge for hours. Yeah, nearly three hours we went, man. Elite level ball knowledge, guys. Two hours, 47 minutes or something we did. Gasparini representing Krusty Codgers Elite. I don't know what that means, bro. Some one player for Arsenal, who would it be? Yeah, probably Messi. I'm surprised with this Liverpool starting 11, by the way. I thought they would have gone for it, but they've obviously got one eye on Fulham away at the weekend. Who just missed a one on one? Oh, yeah, the hipster's playing tonight, isn't he? Yeah, the hipster. The hipster that's walking away with a title against uh, Bayern Munich. The hipster that smashed up Bayern Munich this season. Something we couldn't. Mad. Ain't easy. But yeah, after uh, after I did that show earlier, I thought, oh, let me go and, let me go and have a little swim in the pool. Yeah. Yeah, it's not a good idea getting in the swimming pool on the 11th of April. It was freezing. It was like an ice bath. Even though it's like 26 degrees, it was freezing. I dived in and dived straight back out. Cold plant, bro. I swear down, it was freezing. So I have Palace on the weekend. Now I think they got Fulham, mate. I think they got Fulham, in they? Maybe I'm wrong. Mm. They do have Palace. You're right. What was I looking at? What was I looking at? Oh, I just looked at the. 
Uh, okay, I looked at the second Atalanta game and the game after that. That's what I did. Yeah, they got Palace. Palace at Anfield, guys. Means more FC. Different animal to supermarket point. Yeah, I, mate, I can't drink red. Like, honestly, yeah. Shepherd's pie gives me headaches. <laughs> oh, my days. Atalanta should have scored. I don't know why he'd done a back heel. He should have scored. This game's been uh, 100 mile an hour so far. Oh, my God. They should have scored again. Dead first touch. Straight with the goalkeeper. Just get minerals on the channel. Yeah, he's going to come on Monday 22nd for a Chelsea preview. Offside. Varane is injured. There's a surprise. Up Dewey McStewie. <laughs> what do you think I win between City and Madrid? Well, I still think Madrid will go through. I still think they'll win. Wouldn't it be funny if that hipster's first loss comes to David Moyes? Would be hilarious. Just join the stream means more. Bro! It means more FC. All right, mate. Hey, yeah, the trophies mean more in Liverpool. Yeah, because we're not part of England, lah. <laughs> Do it for Klopp FC, do you know what I mean? Fulham is next week. Yeah, I know. I looked at the second Atlanta game and their first game after that. I was hungry. I'd just come off of that stream with Johnny and I was starving. I looked up, I was like, oh, okay, they've got Fulham. End of May, start of June. Yeah, the pool's freezing, bro. I can't lie. Freezing. Big up to everyone locked in, man. Big up Luke. Big up Snipers. Come on. Atalanta just whacked a free kick straight out of play for a goal kick. Ollie Watkins has put Villa 1 0 up. Bash. Checked out Potts handling talks ball. Come lately, fan cam. <laughs> All right, big up Potts, man. I swear that geezer that was interviewing him didn't even watch the game or had no ball knowledge whatsoever. He thought Ozil would play big games in the Champions League for Madrid. Good one. He played 11 times for Madrid, mate. What big games did he play? Ozil. Did I say Ozil? Odegaard. Yeah, he thought Odegaard had played in big games for Madrid in the Champions League. What big games were these then? Can you name them, mate? So I'm here in Crete. Bro, I swear the swimming pool is so cold. But it's been beautiful, man. Since that eight days of rain straight, yeah, it's been 24, 25, 26. Malmo at home. <laughs> this game's frantic without any real quality at the minute. But both teams are having a go. That's a ball. Noodles is in. Oh, wow. This guy stinks. How's he missed? He put, what are you putting your thumb up for, mate? You missed. <sighs> he was onside as well by a mile. Bit of composure. Open your body up and curl it. You tried to dink him. Idiot. Absolute idiot. He stinks, man. I can't lie. Yeah, Odegaard played 11 times for Real Madrid. I don't know what that case he was wafting about, but big up Potts, man. He absolutely muddied everything that guy was saying. Noodles. Tell him, sweetheart. Tell him. Get his likes up. Come on. Get these likes up. Landed the minerals, bruv. We landed it. Nearly three hours of landing minerals. I'm real now. You scored the best goal you'll ever see. And Mrs. One's on. You know, facts. Absolute facts. 
I was going to do that Olympiacos game, and I changed my mind. <laughs> Nearly bowled it as well. Wow. All right, let's go out of London. Let's go, guys. Cross it. Strike the keeper. Benfica has scored. I guarantee if I Liverpool are away. Yeah? That's a dead pass. I guarantee if I go and check Aston Villa's starting 11, it's a 4 4 2. Guarantee it. Guarantee it. And I guarantee, before I even press search, I guarantee Tillemans is up front with Watkins. Lineups. Ooh. 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 He's actually changed his formation for Europe, guys. I'm in the mud. 4 4 1 1. McGinn behind Watkins. Although that's what it says on Google. So maybe that's not actually what's happening, but I'd imagine it probably is. Yo, get these likes up. Come on, man. What are you doing? 85 likes. Shambolic, guys. Let's have it right. Come on. Some villa. Oh, no, Aston Villa. Yep. Aston Villa has scored, guys. Benfica has scored, have they? Pick up to Brad as well. If, if Zinni didn't start, why did he bring him on? Surely you don't rate him if you're starting Kim. I don't really get it, bro. It makes no sense. But the bench is dead. <laughs> hey, Villa are going to win that competition. Trust me. They're, they're going to win that. And if we don't win anything, they've had a better season, haven't they? One trophy, no trophies. You can't compose a fraud, is shit. Sheffield United have been deducted two points next season. For what? Sheffield United. What have they been deducted for? Let's have a look at this. For defaulting on payments. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear. Roma scored. Big up Roma. But, but it's the Conference League, guys. Need that London score. I thought Liverpool would slap this lot. I can't lie, but it's not looking like that's going to happen right now. It's not looking like it's going to happen, guys. But they're doing it for Klopp. They're doing it for Klopp, guys. Doing it for Klopp FC. So he's doing Bayer Leverkusen West Ham, is he? Same as Rance. I didn't say he was live. What's that all about? I had to literally go to his channel to find out he was live. Pathetic. Interesting. Very interesting. Big up to you, my guy. Come on, big up Rowie. We need a goal. We need the likes up as well. Yeah, it's a disgrace here, guys. Not even got a hundred likes. Adios, guys. Goodbye, guys. We've got 100 likes. Come on, guys. <laughs> See? It's easy. Just press the like button. Digit. Caress it. Flick it. Finger it. 
<laughs> do what you got to do with it. Come on, just caress it slowly. Just. <laughs> Minerals used to leave the stream if they weren't liking either. Yeah, bro, that's what we're going to do from now on. From now on, we're just going to go. People either leave and go and watch someone else or they like the fucking stream, wouldn't they? Big up immortal, bro. Hope you're well, man. <laughs> we need a goal, guys. We need a goal. We need a go. Marv. Hey, wouldn't it be funny if Marv scored the goal for West Ham that beat Bayer Leverkusen saying, Marv, howie. <laughs> and that film goaded, man. Home Alone is the baddest film ever. <laughs> Tony Cotty hat trick. <laughs> yeah, man. Big up, man. Who's the other fella? What was his name? Fucking Trevor Brookin. Get Trevor Brookin out there, mate. Trevor Brookin FC. Big up Zade, man. What are you saying? This has been shocking so far. Mad erratic, this game. Without any quality. Mad erratic. Films are now shit. Yes, they are. There's one nil West Ham written all over it. Bosh, we will be there, guys. Right, Atalanta. We're nearly in, but they're not. So I'm dead touch from Harvey Elliott. Throwing. Kicking off in the West Ham game. The Wet Bandit, you know what I'm saying? Wet Bandit FC. Who started this trend of waving scarves like this? Because that was a thing back in the day, and it's only just come back in this season. So who made this fashionable to get your scarf and start waving them like this? Look at me. I'm a top fan. I wave my scarf around. <laughs> yeah, Spanish fans have been doing it for years. Yeah, like every game. Yeah, now it's coming to English football. Yeah, see English Premier League games all the time now. Who started that? Who's the rudest footballer you've ever spoken to? Probably Shamak. He was a fucking wrong and he was. Proper. He had some six series BMW. White BMW with a cream roof on it, convertible. Can proper off key geezer, bro. I swear down. Get up, man. Oh, he's got a free kick for that. Free kick to uh, means more FC. Never in a million years that foul. Where it's down, Paquet could be sent off. Oi. Oh, that was a thing when Real Madrid were upset. No, they get the white handkerchiefs out for that one, mate. With a wrong and barnet as well, bro. It looked like a bird shit on his head. I swear. <laughs> it did. It looked like a bird just done a fucking straight on his head. Jude's going to get the handkerchief soon. Didn't they boo him the other day? Somebody said that they booed him. Did they actually boo him? What's mean more FC mean? Trent said that the trophies in Liverpool mean more. So now they're called mean more FC. Hey, our trophies mean more, like, because it's Liverpool. Oh, Vieli, oi, that would have been a bad boy goal. Oh, that's mad unlucky. That is mad unlucky. Let's watch a replay of this. Oh, underside of the bar, hit the post and bounced out. Wow. Yeah, apparently, if uh, Liverpool win trophies, it means more because they haven't spent an absolute fortune, apparently. Whereas Man City have. Trent said it, bruv. So it's mean more FC. Means more FC. 
stream is 30 seconds behind <laughs> how unlucky i get these likes up 150 otherwise i'm bouncing bro mineral stream was elite bro we only land the minerals bro we just say it as it is appreciate it man can't big up liam man big up everyone who tuned into that stream bro that stream was class yeah he's he's a real one mate he's a proper proper football fan Because ever never challenged for trophies in Liverpool. Hey, back in the seventies and eighties, mate, they were decent. Everton were very decent. They won what eight league titles. I think the last time they won a trophy was ninety four, wasn't it? Joe Royal, FA Cup. He was their manager. I think it was ninety four, ninety four or ninety five. Cody Gakpu, the good state of this guy. Apparently he was booed, but I can't find anything to suggest he was. Yeah, maybe it's just a rumor, bro. Top off scarf around the neck, the best look. Bosh, tell him, tell him, brother. Singing North London forever. <laughs> Whatever the weather. What a shit song. Goosebumps, though, guys. Under the lights, Champions League anthem. The Champions. Do, 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 do. Watch the whole stream. Absolute facts, bro. Come on, big up, man. Me and Johnny just spit facts, bro, because we ain't got no agendas. We just say what we think, innit? Otherwise, it um it goes all a little bit, you know, agenda merchants, bro. We ain't got no agenda. Win the fucking title, bro. How about that? Oh, but you've got an agenda against this player. No, he's shit. It's as simple as that, mate. Why don't you rate Sacco? It's racially motivated. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> Oi, over the bar. A goal kick. It's racial. Every time you slag off Saka, it's not even slagging him off. It's just actually speaking truth. Yeah, I don't understand the vile hate and abuse he gets online. <laughs> this is racially motivated. Do one. But this is what these people do. Yeah, they'll dismiss anyone, yeah, that actually calls out real talk against said player. So now anyone who calls it out for his stinkers when he drops stinkers, they will now say, This is racially motivated. Because now that shit sticks. Yeah. Oh, you're racist if you're calling Saka out. He's our best player. No, he fucking ain't. Trossard is. Yeah, Trossard is. Trossard's light years clear of him. Should have stayed on his feet, facts. But now, everyone's now, and this is what these people do. Now people that want to say something online about Bukayo Saka now feel scared in case they get called racist. Yeah, that's what they do. Scare tactics, bruv. Yeah, we well, ain't scaring me because I'll say his shit the other night. He was. Yeah, great goal. He dropped a stinker. That's it. That's it. Scored a fantastic goal. Got De Alfonso Davis booked and did nothing until he dived. That's it. What's wrong with saying that? Everyone knows I don't rate Odegaard. But how comes I said he run the show? He was our best player and he was man in the match and he on, always wanted the ball. Yeah, he was back defending. Yeah, he was lucky to stay on the pitch because if Sane went down, yeah, he's getting a straight red card. But why is he the last man defending? Where was our defence? Yeah, but nobody can say anything about me saying that. But, oh, suck, you've got an agenda, mate. Shut up. My agenda is for this football club to win major honours. And if they don't, sack everyone. Sack them. Sack them. Gaslighting. That's what it is, bro. Trossardino. My baller, brother. My baller. Proper baller, bruv. Bosh. They don't even understand how good this guy is. He's our best finisher and he's best technically gifted player at our club. But this is what they do. When the race cards play, Saka has been poor since April. I'm um, black, lol. Bro, he's been poor since, yeah, he's been poor for 12 months. He's been poor since last April. Yeah, let's not forget he ghosted the last eight games last season. Yeah, the amount of games he's ghosted this season and scored a penalty. I don't know how many penalties he scored this season, but it's got to be at least four. Maybe it's five or six, I think. Yeah, and I know you've got to score him. It's not knocking him. Yeah, but his performances this season have been worse than last season. 
He's not been that good this season. That's a ball if he keeps that. No, it bounced off the turf goal kick. His performances this season have not been as good as last season. But he gets GA, guys. That's what I'm saying. And all these GA merchants, mate. Does anyone know how many fucking assists Ronaldinho got? Because I have no idea, bro. Because I don't care. Because I knew he was a top player. But Kyle Sack is a good player. He'll never be world class. Just a sad reality, guys. But people don't like real talk, in it? It's, it scares them. You're fake, you're toxic, you're racist, you're this, you're that. Let them crack on, mate. It's funny, though, because like the amount of chat about Bayern Munich, <laughs> and now all of a sudden it's all about a penalty. Funny, that, isn't it? But I thought we were going to slap them. Worst Bayern team in 30 years, people were telling me. Okay, mate. Gagpo. He's crap, Rav Gagpo. Absolutely awful. Al Halal won the Super Cup. Big up Madawi. Come on. Buzzing. Go on. <laughs> you know how funny, man. What a God was doing free men's work. Facts. Uh, this game is trash. So I'm going for a slash. I'm a poet. I fully know it. Uh, and I'll be back in literally 90 seconds. I'm going to drain this lizard. <laughs> and I'm going to empty the ashtray and get a beer. We're going to watch this Atalanta attack first. Van Disney, what's he going to do here? Yeah, he's won the ball. Good defending, lad. Throwing to Liverpool. Right, I'll be back in 90 seconds. And we missed absolutely nothing, mate. Nada. Incoming goal. Wait for it. Wait for it. Wait for it. <laughs> Yo, big up in the deer, brother. My guy. Let me just put my eye drops in, man, because my eyes need lubricating. I need to lube myself up, bruv. Pause. Oh, sorry. Mate, that feels so good. Oof. We're back. 
Um, after the first leg, who goes through with Walker and KDB back for the second? Uh, also, Froden's score that in the burner bow. Stop that. Can't wait to see him have key the keys. Bro, that goal was a joke. He got man of the match as well, didn't he? Man of the match in the burner bow. Bosh. Jude in the bin, bruv. Jude got put in the bin. I can't lie. Man of the match in the burner bow. Boy. Foden's class, bro. Um, I still think somehow Real Madrid find a way. I just think they'll go through. But listen, flip a coin. Flip a coin. Both of your teams, Real Madrid and obviously your team City, both of your teams are elite, mate. They're just so good. Like, they always find some way, somehow, and somebody comes up clutch every single time, mate. Yeah, the other night, yeah, you're one nil up, Bernardo, bang. Yeah, then bang, bang, Vinny and Rodrigo step up. Yeah, and then all of a sudden, you're like, what, what now? Yeah, cool, say less, Foden, a score a screamer. Yeah, and then Vardy out and just pick one out of nowhere with his weak foot from 25 yards. <laughs> like, then all of a sudden, yeah, Real Madrid go, yo, you want to play that game? Cool, no drama, say less. Yeah, and then Vinny crosses the ball. Valverde, what a fucking goal. Oh, hey, what a goal that was from Atalanta as well. Shit goalkeeping. Bosh, Liverpool in the mud. Scouts is in the bin, lads. They're doing it for Klopp. They ain't fucking doing it now, are they? Bosh! <laughs> oh, hey, put your belly away, you fat fuck. Tuck your T-shirt in, you scruffy bastard. He won't even scouse. <laughs> Klopp's doing that little smirk. <laughs> Means more FC are fucking mudded, bruv. Imagine they bounce out of here on Klopp's final season with just a League Cup. That'll teach him to pick the worst 11 he could have picked. Trent's on the bench. Salah's on the bench. Just saying, isn't it? Just saying. Just saying, guys. Uh, they have on the bench Luis Diaz, Sabostlai, Salah, Jota, Robertson. Hey, Bobby Clark. That's a proper scouse name, isn't it? Bobby. Hey, Bobby. <laughs> Trent, Conza, Bradley. Hey, Connor Bradley. Hey, do you know Connor? Connor who? Connor Bradley, his mates with Bobby Clark. <laughs> God, I love the Scousers. 1 0 to Atlanta, mudded. We'll take it, lads. We'll take it. Are Liverpool winning on field tilt. Does anybody know? Does anybody know the field tilt stats, guys? Unbelievable. Well, at least we've had a goal. The first half weren't a complete disaster. Scallywag. Hey, you're a scally. <laughs> I love the Scouse accent. It's fucking hilarious. Some of the one-liners they come out. Scouse is a class, man. Samaka. Samaka. Hey, Samaka. You dickhead. <laughs> oh, the Scouse accent has got to be up there as one of the worst accents ever, but it's also got to be the funniest as well. Depends. Actually, I'll say I'll take that back. It actually depends what part of Liverpool, because it you could be a posh scouser. Yeah, so you might look at the state of that goalkeeper, man. I've just seen the replay of that. Fucking hell, mate. Didn't this Samaka Skamaka or whatever his name is play for West Ham? Didn't he play for West Ham? Look at him, Justin Bieber, bruv, before the fucking before Diddy Pauls. <laughs> Well, look at the silver surfer. Who's this Atlanta manager, bruv? He, he throw a silver head of hair, bruv. Yeah, he did. He did play for them. Yeah, he flopped, didn't he? Jimmy Cockham. I hate Brookside. Oh, my days. That program's goated. Moisey tried to ruin him. <laughs> hey, Jimmy. I'm being serious. Why are you laughing? I'm being serious. Big up hammers. Come as Redmond. <laughs> you look fucking sick, bro. I swear this chat's wild. <laughs> I 
<laughs> the alt manager is quality. Who's the alt manager, bro? Went to a museum in Liverpool Docklands once. There was a display about the Scouse accent. It comes from Ireland. What? <laughs> is that for real? Is that actually for real? That's mad. Ah, dear. Well, the Atalanta fans are loving life. Look at them. All bouncing up and down. They're over the moon. Liverpool's a shit hole. We wanna go home. We wanna go home. We wanna go home. <laughs> That's a dead ball as well. Oh my days, they're in trouble here. Go on, I beg you get a second one. Just for the banner. Corner. Callis did as well. Oh, you mean the Atlanta manager? <laughs> okay. You know, I never knew that their accent was from Ireland. That's mad. Oh, is that Gasparini, is it? He'll be linked to Chelsea soon, won't he? Oh, but we've got Gasparini coming in. Okay, how many people watch out of London every week? Tough night at Anfield, guys. <laughs> <laughs> What's the postcode of Anfield? Is it L4? Have a look. Anfield postcode. L4. Yeah, I know my fucking shit, don't I? My ball knowledge is dead, though, guys. But I know what Liverpool's postcode is for Anfield. L4, lads. See? I'm talking about. Talking about... Smash these likes up. Come on, guys. That's down going to snooze fest. We're buzzing now. I allow one a trophy now after watch this shit. <laughs> Yo, come big up safe. 2 1 up against Dortmund. Man, like Simeone, bro. El Cholo. Bash, the Rohi Blancos, bruv. They're, they're 2 1 up. Wait, they're getting to the final, trust me. Atalanta have got a chance here. Go on, lad. Nuts. Go on. Shoot. Oh, man. Man. As a Barca fan, I'd like to thank Enrique for not playing in Papi last night. <laughs> he was awful, mate. He was awful. I swear, he was stinky as hell, mate. I can't lie. He was stinky. We got Maseko, man. We're doing it for Klopla. I'm being serious. <laughs> I actually like Liverpool. But Liverpool fans probably think I take the piss all the time. I actually like Liverpool. Like, maybe not so much as the club. Yeah, but like their fans are pretty cool, I can't lie. I've been to that stadium enough times. Always cool, man. And Liverpool is a city is actually not bad. Wouldn't want to live there. It's full of scousers, but <laughs> but Liverpool's actually quite nice. That's a ball. Go on, lad. He's clean through. Clean through. Go on. Oh, you fucking useless. You should have dinked him straight away. Kelleher's fucking made two saves with his forehead. Goal kick. Mad. Liverpool looked rattled, though. I can't lie. I can't believe he's missed that. Why is he trying to chip him flair? Drop a shoulder, go round him. He should have chipped him earlier. Didn't need to take a touch. The touch should have been the dink. Look at the state of that defending. Right, now dink it there. He took that extra touch. No need. Uh, half time, guys. Klopp's jogging. He's off. He obviously needs a shit. 
can't hold it anymore. But yeah, Liverpool nil, Atalanta one. And um, the scary, intimidating, terrifying Liverpool are losing one nil at home. It's a Maka goal. Oh, we'll bring on the big boys to say probably. Atalanta are scary and scintillating and silence the Anfield faithful. <laughs> Doing it for Norbert, lads. <laughs> Like Liverpool's atmosphere is mad overrated. I can't lie, yeah. Like, I've not been there on a European night, of course. Look at the state of that. Look. I still ain't gone. I'm going to do it tomorrow, I think. I'm going to go and get these taken back, man. That is fucking killing me. Look at the imprint on the side of my big beak, bruv. Look at this. I think them things are way too tight. Way too tight. But anyway. Let's carry on, guys. Atalanta hate is an illness. Leverkusen nil. Massives nil. West Ham are tragic. Everywhere they go. Everywhere they go. Big up to Nadir as well, my bro. Thing is, we're a bit shit. Only Bernardo Grealish had good games. The rest mid, just individual brilliance, saved us um, at home. With we're different six years undefeated in the champions league yeah you are the last time you lost a game at home in the champions league super mick managed that game against leon i think pep's mum passed away and arteta took charge of that game and that's the last time you've lost at home in the champions league <laughs> unbelievable big up for the super chat as well man appreciate it bro get these likes up come on io di puta io di mutante yeah, come on, guys. Yeah, come on, let's go, guys. Smash these like buttons. 175 on the likes is a disgrace here, guys. I feel embarrassed, guys. Uh, big up to Stephen Somerville, Irish Rugby. Thank you for the super chat, my guy. Uh, well, I'm a Liverpool fan. Um, and to be fair, I can't believe certain people thought we were going to easily win the league. I think Arsenal and City are, more better, are better in terms of consistency. And actually scoring. See, this is the thing there. Yeah? I don't think anyone thought Liverpool would be up there. Uh, but this is the same as last season with Arsenal. Nobody thought Arsenal would have a chance to win the league. But that doesn't stop you winning the league. I've seen, I've, like, I was watching Mo's channel earlier. Yeah, and he had that Rory Talks fucking retard on there. Like, what a weird guy, bruv. Yeah, but what's harder to do, yeah? Arsenal winning the Champions League, yeah? Or Man City doing a treble? Well, what's harder to do, mate? Three trophies or one? Fucking, what are you talking about? Yeah, LB muddied him every time, bruv. Yeah, but nobody expected it. Okay, so because nobody expects it doesn't mean it can't be done. Yeah, but the probability will be less. Well, it still can be done, though, isn't it? Yeah, but I'll be honest. Yeah, when you overhaul your whole midfield in, in the summer, yeah, I'm shocked. I can't lie. I am shocked. But now you're there. And Klopp's announced he's going. You must win something. I know you've got the League Cup in the bin, or in the bin, in the bag, even in the bin. Uh, I wish I had a League Cup this season, but um, you now have to go and win something else. Otherwise, all of the the hype it'd just be an anti climax. If you like, listen, it's hard to win the league. Of course, it is. Right, especially with Pep and Man City, they're fucking relentless. But at the same time, like. You're not in the FA Cup. You've won the League Cup. You have to win the Europa or the Prem. Otherwise, he walks out with just a League Cup in his final season. All right, and he's a quality manager. I like Klopp. He's, he's unreal. But And it's, it's kind of unfortunate that he's gone up against Pep. But at the same time, at the same time, you could have won more with him. You know, if he'd been less naive and less like heavy metal football yeah, and just shored it up a little bit in games instead of just going 100 mile an hour all the time you probably could have won another couple of prems but it's going to be interesting man it's going to be interesting to see uh who actually does win it because all three of us all three of us have got tricky fixtures man yeah man city got tottenham away they've never scored a goal there um at the new one anyway why is my missus spam she knows i'm working what is wrong with this woman Thanks for the super chat, though, bro. Come on. Right, what do you want?
Do you know what winds me up with people as well? Like my missus does this all the time. It fucking jars the life out of me when people do this. Instead of just writing one big long text message, ping, 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 ping. You're like, why don't you just write it in one text instead of fucking spamming my phone? They send like seven, eight, nine text messages in one, boom, 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 one after another. It winds me up. Proper winds me up. Just send it all in one long text message, mate. I can read. I don't need to go ping, 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 ping. Get out of here, man. Drives me insane. It's not even just females, bro. Some of my pals do it as well. I'm just like, I tell them all the time. Or send a voice message. Exactly. Do you know what I'm saying? My phone is on do not disturb and silent all the time. All the time, 24-7, do not disturb and silent. But it's jarring, man. <laughs> showing your age. I am showing my age. But like I don't I don't get I'm like like I said, my phone's on silent, do not disturb, but it's just like you'll get ping. Like, well, not ping, but it just a like, message. I'll open it. Type in another one. So you're now starting to type, but now you're waiting for the another one. So you carry on typing. Now you've got to go through eight different... I fucking get up. Nah, man. It's jarring. Either send a voice message. I've just seen that Roma go. Just send a voice message or just send one message. Even if it's this long, just send one message. I don't need doom, 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 doom. It's jarring. Now, my missus does it all the time, man. Yeah, and some of my pals do it. I tell them all the time. Why are you sending me 10 messages? Just send it in one. Yeah, that's what I do, bro. I'm not even lying, bro. I've got mates in my phone, yeah? Like actual pals that I've been to football with and stuff, yeah? I ain't even got their numbers saved. <laughs> I've not even got their numbers saved, bro. <laughs> I just can't be asked. I've right, just seen that Benfica goal. That was half tidy. Right, let me take these off for five minutes. This is fucking happening, man. Yeah, I've got people in my phone. Bro, I've got messages sat there since June last year that I ain't even opened. I ain't got time for it. Busy. I don't want to fucking talk to anyone. Now I can't see the screen. Just seen Watkins goal. Oh, Prince Prince Williams got himself a freebie again. Good edit, though. I literally can't see that. I can see it's there because it's yellow, but I can't see any of the text. I literally can't see any of that. Let's watch this Olympiacos Fenerbahce game. What is that defending, bro? Ooh, nice goal. First goal was decent. Shit defending. That's a good goal. Oh, his second goal was decent as well. He looked well offside, but he weren't. That was a sick goal. Big up Rahorn, man. I can see now. Uh, I thought the At Atalanta was going to be a walk in the park. Never count Serie A teams out, guys. Tell them, bruv. Oh, the third goal was the fucking hell. All Olympiacos' finishes were top draw, man. Proper, proper finish. Yeah, that's a mad goal. Yeah, tell them, bro, Farmers League's in that. Do you know what I'm saying? Farmers Leagues. Wow, he gave a penalty for that. That was never a pen. 
Yeah, farmers leagues, bro. That's what it is. Like all these leagues are shit, isn't it? The Premier's the best in the world, apparently. <laughs> Thanks for the super chat, my bro. Come on. I said if you pour milk up your nose, you can scrape your eyes. Oh dear. We're addicted to eye drops. It's scary and dangerous. Who's won seven Champions Leagues? Who? Do you agree that Liverpool are the biggest club in England or do you agree with Flowers that it is Man United? Seven Champions. They've only won six, bro. That's not bad, is it? <laughs> but they've only won six, not seven. Um, I'd say United. I'd say United, if I'm honest. You can flip a coin on either of them, but I'd say Man United. Have you ever drunk the prime drink? Nope. I see that for sale the other day in the shop I went in. It was like five euro ninety nine for one bowl. I was like, who's paying that? Five English teams mid in Europe. Because right, they've got hardly any players that have got technical ability in their team, bro. Most of them are just pace and power. And not only that, when you've got extremely talented footballers in your team, like these, some of these European teams do, they know how to slow the game down. Yeah, and play it to the pace they want. Whereas in the Prem, 100 mile an hour, scatterball, scatterball. Look at the state of that game tonight. Look at the state of the game we're watching. Yeah, look at the state of that. That was 100 mile an hour. Boom, 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 just erratic. Now look at the Bayern Munich Arsenal game or Arsenal Bayern Munich game the other night. We see some good football in that game. Yeah, second half, Harry Kane masterclass. He was fucking insane in that second half. The passing was ridiculous. His passing is so underrated. Yeah, top baller. But they know how to slow the game down. Yeah, they also know when to go boom, boom, boom. Three passes are in the box. Yeah, because that's what they do. Play a slow, methodical game. Yeah, with quality. Yeah, and awareness. And they're always looking around going, right, I, okay, cool. What I'll do is a boom, and I'll play it to him. Boom. Straight in the box. Whereas with us, it's erratic, no tech, no football in IQ. Yeah, and this is why England don't clean up. Yeah, fair play to City. Fair play to West Ham last season. But this is why Spanish teams fucking wipe the floor with, with English teams most of the time. Because the Spanish teams, they don't do all of this crap. They don't do it, bro. Spanish teams clean up in Europe. Right, we've got some subs coming on. Salah's coming on. Sebastian is coming on. Did you watch City Madrid? Yeah, I watched it after I finished work the other night. System players, exactly. Robertson's coming on as well. System players. And this is the thing as well, yeah? Like, Real Madrid, does anyone know their system? System player. Who's a system player for Madrid? Maybe Jude. You could say maybe Jude, but is he really a system player? I don't really know. They don't really have a system that is a rigid system. Because every time I watch Real Madrid, yeah, Vinny's on the left, and, and Rodrigo's on the right. Ten minutes later, they've swapped. That used to be a thing back in the day when we when I was growing up. Yeah, your wingers have swapped sides ten minutes into the game if they weren't getting joy out of the fullback. Oh, you have a go over there. I'll go on your side, mate. Why don't that happen anymore? But Real Madrid do that and they swap. I said Messi was a system player. Jeez. I'm, I, 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 bro, I prefer not to speak. If I speak, I'm in big trouble, guys. Big trouble, guys. If I speak, I'm in big trouble. So I'm going to press the start on this uh, second half and go for a slash. Wow. Let's go, guys. I'll be back. I can't even see the screen. <laughs> I'll be back in one minute, guys.
Right. Means more FC haven't scored. What's that all about? Why haven't they scored, guys? They made a treble sub. Heavy metal football in that. Big up to everyone locks in, man. Smash the likes up, guys. Smash the like button, guys. Jack are balling for Leverkusen, is he? Liverpool got a charge on goal here. And what is that, guys? Corner. Anyway, guys, Messi's a system player, so yeah. And said it was a joke. <laughs> is that after you got smoked in the chat, or is it actually a joke? <laughs> Bosh! Even if it was a joke. Bosh! Have a mutant. Have a mutant one, bruv. Well, I big up for watching, though. Real talk. Yeah, thank you, mate. And listen, whether it was a joke or not, bruv, we don't, we don't do that, bruv. Nah, come on, bruv. Messy. The goat, bruv. The goat. That was a good cross from Sebastian. I cleared. The real talk were Mbappe bench Vinny if he goes to Madrid. Nope. 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 They all play. All three of them. All three of them play. Uh, big up to HN, man. Uh, Luis Diaz reminds me an actor, Luis Guzman. Hashanga from Carlitos. <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. To be fair, the actor's probably a better footballer. Probably a better footballer, guys. My eyes are so dry, man. That's what happens when you do five hours straight streaming. Oh, Literally. Super dry. Probably shouldn't have done nearly three hours with Johnny Minerals. Bosh, this isn't Chels, guys. This isn't Chels. Yeah, big up HN, man. Appreciate it, bro. We got Vegas Gunner as well. Come on. Real one as well. Top employs a hybrid kickball basketball tactic, spamming crosses. It's effective if you have enough athletes in attacking positions and outside all outside backs. Facts, bro. This is absolutely yeah. Me and Ransom have been saying this for the longest. 100 mile an hour. Yeah, spam, 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 spam. Yeah, it's great. Listen, it works. I'm not knocking it. I'm not knocking it. It's better than watching fucking Man City this season. That's a good pass. Cross it. Yeah, it's better than watching Man City's U shaped football, horseshoe football, boring walking football. Yeah, and, it, and it's very effective. Yeah, because it, it it's just like you suffocate the defense, like you suffocate the other team, like you're just on them all the time. It's relentless, relentless, relentless. Which is why when they this is why they score so many goals right at the end of football matches. Because they're just relentless, relentless, relentless. You've got to rate it, man. You've got to rate it. They should have scored as well off the corner, Virgil van Dijk. But at the same time. You're right. It's based on pace and power, merchants. Yeah, they ain't really got much tech in that team, have they? Let's be real. Even when they had um, back in the day on the club, that front three, Sadio Mane was mad erratic. Salah's always been erratic. Yeah, the only one in that front three that had any tech was Firmino. Yeah, and even the midfield. Like Fabinho, Henderson, and fucking Wijnaldum. The best one out of the three was Wijnaldum. And even he weren't like mad, mad amazing. He was just very good. Now you look at the midfield now. Endo. He ain't amazing, is he? He's just a very good, tidy engine. Yeah, he'll get up and down the pitch. He'll plug the gaps. McAllister's saucy. I can't lie. McAllister's got tech. He's a good player. But he's the only one in that midfield. What's he giving it? Free kick out of Lana. Endo's giving a free kick away. Big up Vegas, though, man. Hope you're well, man. And thank you for that, bro. 
from Big Six, who's from the Big Six, who's their underrated player? What for each team? For Man City, I'd say Ake. Somebody asked me this the other day, I think. Ake is the most underrated for Man City. Liverpool. I'd probably say Robertson. Nobody really rates Robertson. Nobody fucking... Nobody outside of Liverpool fans rate him, really. Let's be real with it. No, but he's actually not a bad defender at all. Yeah, for Arsenal, it's 100% my baller, Tross Ardinho. For top Spurs... What are they doing with this free kick? Fucking get on with it, mate. For Spurs... Oh, I nearly went in. Good save. Now they're breaking. Who's, who's Spurs' most underrated player? Harvey Elliott's good. Yeah, Harvey Elliott is very good. And he's got tech, which is why he don't play often. He don't play often because he's too technically good for that team. Yeah, he'd be better in Man City's team or Arsenal's team. And for this Liverpool team, it's all 100 mile an hour, pace and power. I'd say for Spurs, yeah, Pape Sars is a shell, but we ain't got a long enough window window sample size for him. Liverpool in it. Get it out. Oh my days. Get it out. Get it out. Get a fucking state of salad, bruv. No doubt it's stink a fucking penalty. Um Spurs, most underrated. Pedro Porro, probably. Nobody rates him either. He's actually gone up this season a level as well. Probably two levels. Porro's probably... Get it out. Save. Yeah, Porro last season, everyone was like, ooh, I'm not sure about that. Yeah, and this season, I don't see any rival fans of, of Tottenham or like just any football fans other than Tottenham fans rating him. Like the same with Robertson, really. I said Fraser Forster. <laughs> Van der Ven's class, but again, like it's only this season. It's maybe a one season wonder, isn't it? This Poro is in his second season, so it's like Poro had more assists than Trent at one point. There you go. But that's what that's what I'm saying. Liverpool, yeah, fucking Gakpu, 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 get rid. Oh my days, Darwin Nunes stinks, bruv. And this is what are you clapping for? What's he clapping for? They're doing it for Klopp, lah. Hey, we got Darwin. Hey, don't worry, lah. We got Darwin Nunes. He's fucking awful. Not Portugal, is it, bruv? It ain't easy. Klopp looks stressed, mate. Look at him. He looks stressed. <laughs> and this is why they won't win the league. Because they miss way too many chances. And this is what happens when you have pace and power merchants in your team. And you don't really have any techie ballers. Yeah, and the techie baller they've got plays in midfield. Or on the wing, in, if, if you're Harvey Elliott who doesn't have the output of Salah, which is why he barely plays. Look at the state of Gakpo, look at him. Salah. Darwin again, bro. This guy is awful. The FD United, their most underrated player is Dallo. He's quality. I like Dallo. For proper Chelsea, for proper Chelsea, I'd say their most underrated player. Most underrated player for Chelsea. 2 0 Benfica, no Northside meltdowns. Who's Chelsea's most underrated player? <laughs> I 
Like Dallo is decent. Come on, man. Dallo is a good player. He can cross a ball, he can defend, and he can play left or right. He's actually decent. And like he's funky now. He's joking. I smashed these likes up. Come on, man. 250 we need ASAP. Why are you not supporting United? Why would I support United, bro? Who's Chelsea's most underrated player? Probably their goalkeeper. Yeah, you're probably right. Although he's only been there this season, so we need somebody that's been there longer. Want somebody that's been there a couple of years, maybe. I don't know. My wake is shit. I can't like Sterling's awful. Petrovic is decent though. I can't lie. He's not bad. Palmer's rated though. I can't lie, bro. He is rated. Rival fans rate him. Mudrick's dog shit. <laughs> Michael Jackson. Uh, Darwin's been hooked, lads, after dropping a zero out of ten again. He's missed about four sitters tonight. Luis Diaz is on. Colwell's overrated. Mad overrated by their fans. We got DJ Jamie. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, Gusto, but again, he's only just got there. They haven't really got anyone that's been there a couple of years, have they? Look, this half decent or under or underrated. I don't know. That's a tough one. That's a tough one because everyone rates Tiago Silva. Villa are two 0 up, are they? Oh yeah, At Atalanta are two 0 up. Bash Gamaka with the dagger at Anfield. <laughs> Hey, but they're doing it for Klopla. Oh, that was a sick finish as well. See, heavy metal football, lads. Heavy metal football, when you've got dead ballers in the team, they've got no tech whatsoever. They keep missing sitters. And here we are, 2 nil down. Liverpool 2 nil down, guys. He's well offside, guys. No, he's not offside. I thought it was... No, he's not offside. What a finish. Hey, what a finish, guys. That's a good goal. It was a good goal, wasn't it? Hey, the League Cup. The League Cup, la. The Carabao Cup, la. It means more. It means more, guys. Hey, I'm being serious. 2 0 down. In the bin. The starting 11 was ridiculous, though. He's only got himself to blame. Look at Salah fucking stay here. Another one. And this is the problem, guys. He's left before it all capitulates. This is what he's doing. He's smart. He left Dortmund before it all fell apart. He's leaving. Look, look at the Scousers. Hey. <laughs> he knows what he's doing. He knows this team is shit, bro. Yeah, and he's done all right to get him at the top of the table or second in the table. He's, he's won him a cup, but he knows in the next couple of years he's going to be mid-table, mate. So he's left. He did the same at Dortmund. Vibes FC, you know what I'm saying? He's smart. He'll be at Real Madrid in a couple of years. Or next year, maybe next summer, when Ancelotti goes. When Ancelotti goes, I'd, I'd be shocked if he ain't their manager. Or well, it depends what Xavi Alonso does. Xavi Alonso goes and wins the title again next season and goes on a Mazza again next season, then maybe he'll be Real Madrid manager. That was a sick finish. That was a sick finish. It means more. Now, win more, mate. We are better than Liverpool. We are. We're winning the league. We'll see. We shall see, guys. Well, Beck Salah, I told these man, bruv, they don't want to hear it. Yeah? 
But 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 he scored over two hundred goals for Liverpool. Yeah. Now go back and look through them two hundred goals that he scored. Yeah, and have a look at every single one of them games where he scored, and watch his performance. He's been shitting half of them. Like at the weekend. The weekend just gone. I said in the first half of that game. Yeah, I said he's done nothing. But he'll get a, he'll score a penalty. And all's forgiven. What happened? He scored a penalty. I wouldn't even say they're all fluky goals. He scored some great goals. I think he scored. It was a screamer against Chelsea. He curled one in. He scored some very good goals. The goal against Man City, where he went round a two or three bang. He scored some very good goals. Yeah. But to put him in conversations with Omri and Aguero and all these man, nah, 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 nah. Sorry, stop it. Stop it. Get some help. I feel silent. It's silent every time I went there, bro. It's a myth. It's a myth. Yeah, and the thing is, I don't dislike Liverpool. Yeah, you know, people go, "Oh, you got an agenda against Liverpool?" No, I ain't. I just say what I think, in it. Yo, they're in again. It's it. It's it. It's it. It's it. Oh, you got a score, bro. That should have been three nil. That should have been the tie over. That should have been fucking three nil. How is he shanked that? The state of that. I mean, in the Premier, whatever. Yo, that's that's mad. I, right, bro, I'm gonna. Have to, I could probably do a whole video on that. <laughs> I probably could. Yeah, Nadir, I could probably do a whole video on that at some point. Most underrated, three most underrated players from each uh, big six team in Premier. I could probably do that. I could do that in the summer. Yeah, keep your eyes peeled. We're on that. Remind me though, but I'm on that. Three players from each top six team, most underrated in the Premier. We'll go with that one. We'll go with that. Excuse me. Uh, we'll go with that. Scouse is a fuming. Look at him. Big up for the super chat as well, bro. Big up to Phil as well, man. Big up, Lee. You know London is still blue. Blue with envy. <laughs> Bosh. Big up to you, my guy. Come on. Throw up at Chelsea. Throw up at Chelsea. Come back when you overtake us on trophies one. You're not far behind. Only a couple behind, I think. All right, what's, what's Sally going to do? Nuts. Well, he nuts. He nuts him. All of a sudden, they don't want to take forever to take a throw in or a free kick or anything now. Yeah, really? Oh, okay. Why? Why? All of a sudden, you want to take quick throw ins and that. Yeah. Why? Watch when. Watch when Liverpool get a free kick. Yeah. Watch how quick they take the free kick. None of this one minute twenty five seconds take a free kick now. Yeah. And this is why I fucking get the um with football. Yeah, because it's like when it's nil nil or one one. It literally takes over a minute to take a free kick. You watch now, yeah? If this lot get a free kick on the edge of the box, it ain't taking a minute. Yeah, corners take 45 seconds. Look how quick Sabostai took that throw in. It was probably a foul throw in as well. All of a sudden, they want to go 100 mile an hour. Why didn't they start like that? Big up Phil, man. Yo, big up to everyone locked in. Four, 499 people in here, man. We ain't even hit 300 likes. Come on, guys. Let's go, guys. Scouse is in the mud. It means more FC. They're doing it for Klopp FC. A finished right now. Seller was offside, surely. Yep. Brain dead. Brain dead, guys. A bit like Mbappe last night. All that pace. Look at Klopp. <laughs> He's proper special. Proper special, bro. <laughs> What's he doing? What is he doing? Big up James as well, man. Come on, my guy, bro. Big up Vegas, man. I think Curtis Jones has potential, just not a Klopp's hype player. That's how much Klopp bigs up Martinelli. He likes that profile. He likes mad erratic players, bro, that are 100 mile an hour. That's what he likes. Yeah, Martinelli could 
could yeah, be borderline world class. He'll never be world class or borderline world class in this system that we play right now. Yo, two nutmegs in one go, bro. Who's number 22 for Atlanta? Man just nutmeg two players in one hit. <laughs> Who's number 22, bro? He literally just nutmeg two men in one hit. <laughs> what? Two nuts in one go, bro. Pause. Yeah, Martinelli has got very good tech. He's quick. He's direct. Mad jarring, though, I can't lie. And he's not he's not developed under this manager. He ain't. But you're right, he's definitely a clock player. 100%. 100%. Do they know for they play for a European powerhouse? Look at the state of Gakpu, bruv. This guy is horrible to watch. Do they know it's Christmas time at all? Two shots on target for Liverpool in the entire game. Two shots on target, guys. McAllister's has given the ball away. Uh, Darwin Nunes could have had about four goals tonight, but um, he can't. He can't hit the target, lads, and he's got hooked after dropping a stinker. Couldn't score in a brothel. Couldn't finish a wank. Mad, crazy. Big up Mohammed, bro. Appreciate it, man. Big up to Thermal as well. Tech PMP facts. Bear runners, no techie ballers. Facts. But this is what Liverpool are, bro. Barely any technical gifted footballers, technically gifted footballers, just pace and power, 100 mile an hour, mad erratic football, and just spam, 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 yeah, cause panic and mayhem, yeah, and just hope they don't get done on the counter. And this is what they do. I'm a fucking professional, lad. Uh, this is what I do. Yeah, and this is what they do. And listen, it works. Hence why they've won so much. Yeah, but at the same time, yeah, it can be undone, like tonight. Like tonight, guys. Right, now he's definitely Liverpool. 100%, bro. <laughs> Yo, pam these legs up, guys. But no doubt they'll get a goal back. And then Salah a stinker penalty. He's just dropped another stinker right there. Joe Gomez has put one wide. This is Liverpool, bruv. This is Liverpool. This is Liverpool. Well, shit in a bag and punch it. But it's still 2 0 up. We are disallowed the little goal. Bush. West Ham are still nil nil. Bamiang's pulled one back. Did he celebrate? Tell me he didn't celebrate. Tell me he didn't celebrate, guys. Tell me he just run back to the halfway line. Tell me just run back to the halfway line, please. <laughs> Where's the famous Anfield atmosphere? Mate, Liverpool's atmosphere is shocking. I've never been on a Champions League night, like I've said. Yeah, but every time I've been to Anfield, seven, eight times, whatever it may be, six, seven, eight times, I've, they don't sing until they score. Speakers FC. How is it a myth, bruv? Because they're dead, bruv. Yeah, I've been there six, seven, eight times. I've never seen Arsenal win at Anfield, by the way. Yeah, but they don't sing till they're winning. They, they do the never walk alone thing at the beginning. And that's it. Atlanta, serious team. Yeah, come on, big up, bro. Come on. Big up, Cabo, man. 
dead feel. I've been with Bayern Munich to um, field in 19, 2019. It was dead. Bro, that's what I'm saying. It is dead. Yeah, it's mad overrated. But Jose said it and Fergie said it and Wenger said it. Yeah, Everton do have a better atmosphere. Real talk. I've been to Goodison enough times as well. Everton's atmosphere is better than Liverpool's. Yeah, maybe on the Champions League night when they're up against it. Yeah, and fucking they're free, 4 0 down, whatever it was against Barca and all that. Yeah, cool. Yeah. I've been to both of them grounds, yeah. Everton Stadium's louder. True, when I went to Am. There you go. Bro, the loudest stadium I've been to, yeah, is Atleti. It's the nicest stadium as well. Salah with another hospital pass. Atlanta are doing all right here, man. Unlucky. Look like there are a few more. <laughs> Yeah, Palace atmosphere is sick. Palace and Newcastle are the best away uh, way grounds. Like best away days in the Premier League. Palace, 100. Newcastle just because of the night out, if I'm honest. All right, three on two here. Three on two for Atalanta. Go on, lad. Skamaka. That's dead. Spurs Stadium. I've not been to the new one. Final is loud. Yeah, I see Steve went there. Big Steve went there. And these glasses are killing me, man. I could have stated that, look. And the thing is, I could go to sleep right now and wake up in 12 hours from now and that would still be there. <laughs> it's jarring, man. I need to stop. I need to go and get these sorted. I'm going to do it tomorrow, I think. I need to pick the Mrs. Boy up tomorrow from, from school. And take him to the policia. Oh, they found out who they fa he's found out who fucking nicked his scooter, his electric scooter. They got the CCTV and the gym know who's done it as well. Man, this is proper hurting. So yeah, I've got to take him um take him police station tomorrow. And I think I'm gonna go and get these changed or Hopefully, well, it probably won't get changed tomorrow, but maybe they can. I don't want to fucking move these things, but they are proper killing me. No, they're not too heavy. It's just the, the separator things are too tight. They're too tight, man. I was like, and I've done fucking nearly three hours with Johnny Minerals earlier and then came straight onto this watch along. Get up. Get up. Giving a free kick outside the box. Yeah, I did two hours 45 with Johnny Minerals. Had some food. And that's never a foul. And then came straight on here. And the thing is, when I take them off, I literally can't see any of that. I can't see the chat. I can see there's words there, but I can't see any of it. I, I can't actually focus on it. Focus. We're going to go and focus on another Victoria Malaga. McGeary got booked. I'll be one minute, yeah? I'm going to have a slash as well, guys. I'll be back.
Oh, see, they wasted the free kick. There you go. Salah's stat padded the fucking goal. Oh, he's offside. <laughs> How unlucky. <laughs> How unlucky. How unlucky, guys. Unlucky. Paul Pala, Paul Pala, bunnying down. Wait, that's fucking tight, though. That was very tight. I think he is just off, though. Gasparini following up on Liverpool's downfall. Bosh! Big up, Ed, man. Big up, Ed. Klopp's fuming. They're checking it. That was very tight. That was very, very tight, guys. Wait, he's offside. But, 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 but they didn't put the lines up on the screen, guys. So they didn't check it properly. Because if they don't show it on the screen, guys, then that means they didn't check it. Free kick to Atlanta. Shut up, Kanate. Look at him rattled. Book him. Big up, Ed, man. Love for that, my bro. Yo, get these likes up, guys. Come on, 500 inside. Shut up. He's still moaning. I thought they were mentality monsters. What are you moaning for? Come on, man. There's 10 minutes to go. You can score three goals in that time. The Silver Surfer's out Fox Clock, bruv. Big up, Nadir. It's the reason I hated when they slated our players who are techie and can do more. Also the reason why we won more. Facts. Bruv, listen. Technical ability will always outweigh pace and power. Go on. Oh, you've got a score. That should have been fucking free. That should have been 3 0. Samakis could have should have scored his hat trick. Skamaka should have buried that. That should have been 3 0. That should have been 3 0. Nadir, you're spot on. Technical ability will always outweigh pace and power, which is why if you go back to 2000, the year 2000, and go to every single final a Spanish team has got to in the Europa League or the Champions League. 18 finals against non-Spanish teams. They've won all of them. 18 out of 18, bruv. Why? Because you can have all the pace and power in the world, motherfucker. We'll just pass the ball around you, innit? That's what it is, bruv. We just passed the ball round you. Just passed the ball round you. But, but, but Liverpool were robbed, guys. Mo no salad. No salad. <laughs> Moon the likes, ratas. Come on, guys. Big up to everyone locked in. Zaid, what are you saying, brother? Yeah, you're doing it for Klopp still, bruv. <laughs> look at the state of this. Look, look at this. Look. He's won a free kick out of that, you lucky fuck. That's a throw. Pet ball is awful. I can't lie. This season, pet ball is disgusting. However, pet ball at Barcelona is the best I've ever seen in my life. And pet ball at Man City, when he like, first got there, first couple of seasons there, yo, they fucked this up. Go on, keep going. They're in. Shoot. Shoot. 3 0, guys. <laughs> hey, 3 0, lads. 3 0. Hey, my man nearly headbutted the camera. <laughs> Who even was he? <laughs> Gasparini, look at him. Bah, silver surfer settings, bruv. Liverpool mudded. Liverpool absolutely in the bin. En la basura, io de puta. <laughs> Look at the scousers, bruv. There are a few. Look at Klopp. <laughs> hey, but they're doing it for Klopp, la. Hey, they're doing it for Klopp. Look at the boss, la, bruv. What are you doing? I thought he messed it up as well. Oh, he's on as well. He's on side. Bosh. Hey, they're doing it for Klopp. It means more, la. 
Right, let's wind up the Twitter mutants. Let's wind them up. Let's wind them up. Let's put a tweet out. They're doing it for Klopla. <laughs> Look at Van Dyke. So boss line. The next the next Gerard, the Hungarian Gerard and that, yeah. Yeah, more like fucking in fact John Joe Shelby was better than him. I can't even lie. Off the line. Good defending at Atlanta. More like the fucking Hungarian fucking Charlie Adam. <laughs> They're away again. <laughs> I don't I beg they get a fourth. Please. Batter them. Means more FC in the bin. <laughs> but, 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 we're doing it for Klopp, guys. In fact, fuck that. I'm just going to put, I thought they were doing it for Klopp. <laughs> we'll have all these scousers on a mad one trying to count some weed. He got his starting 11 fucking off key tonight. He completely nulls that up tonight, Klopp. Completely effed that up. Mm, mad thing, mad thing, bro. Jeez, I have enough mutants in my notifications. Fucking hell, I haven't been on. When was my last tweet on Twitter? Seven hours ago. Before that, it was yesterday. But, but, but you're always on Twitter. You have multiple burner. Wait, the scousers are leaving. Why are they all leaving, guys? Why are they all leaving? Why are they all leaving? It makes no sense. Why are they all leaving? Why are they all leaving? I don't get it. They've been absolutely... Oh, I buy her a fucking squad. No, Moisey. Moisey. Yeah. Moisey, you are nothing. You're a fool. Good night. You got the job on a technicality of a legend who recommended you. You are the biggest fool in Manchester. Big up Andy Tate. <laughs> Big up Maseko as well. My guy, this ain't loot and Atalanta is quality. Bosh. You know what I'm saying? Come on, bruv. This is how we roll. I, I can't believe it. I thought I thought they'd spank Atalanta. I can't lie. But then I see that starting 11. I was like, nah, he's got one eye on the weekend. He's got one eye on the weekend. He completely fucked that tonight, Klopp. I'm sorry, listen, I like Jurgen Klopp, and all jokes aside, yeah, I know I banter the scouts isn't that because they're easy to rattle, right? But, 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 guys, we're a famine. Tough night at Anfield. Tough night in L4, guys. <laughs> I can't lie. His starting 11 tonight was pathetic. Yeah, and I said this on the end of Johnny Mimmel stream that I did. Nearly three hours, by the way. Oh, my days. Look at the state of that header. Look at the state of that header. Wow. Mo salad, mo salad. Look at Klopp. <laughs> hey, hey, I'm being serious. I'm being serious. Imagine getting Pam free new at home. Where are this team in the league? Let's have a look where they are in the league. 
sixth. 32 points off top. 32 points off top. They do have a game in hand, however, so they could be 29 points off top. They're behind Roma, Bologna, Juve, Milan and Inter. Oh, look, there's the hipster team, Napoli. Oh, look, they're seventh. Where's Cavradonna? Because I thought he was the second coming of Messi, bro. I thought he was the Georgian. Nah, 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 nah bro. There yeah, comes. Get out of it, man. Big up Maseko, my guy. Come on, smash these likes up, guys. Get these likes up. Uh, we're back again tomorrow uh, for Real Betis versus Celta Vigo. Uh, no fat Spanish waiter anymore. He got sacked. Rafa Benitez got sacked, bro. Since they sacked him, they've actually played good football, Celta, because they played stinky football before. Worst in the league. Uh, so now, that should be a good game of football tomorrow. Isco FC is back again. We will be there, guys. We need a fourth just for the man now. Don't let this lot score a goal because it'll give them hope. Don't let them score. It'll give them hope. Straight at the keeper. Good save. Go on, lad. Big up Luke Tompkins, man. Always love my guy. Why do you think Arsenal fans get so rattled when other people criticise Arsenal? Surely everyone is entitled to their opinion. No, you're not allowed, mate. It's toxic, negative, hate, an agenda, an illness, a sickness. It's an illness, a sickness, and repulsive. Disgusting hate. Fear and hate. A sickness, an illness, Next, it'll be a pandemic. <laughs> Look at the state of Jota's head up. Jesus Christ. But they're so soft, bro. That's what it is. Yeah. They love everyone to gas us up. And this is the funny thing. Rory Talks fucking retard, bruv, was on with Mo earlier. Yeah. LB cooked him. LB cooked him, bruv. Yeah. We've got the best centre back pairing. We've got the best young manager in the world. We've got the best right winger on the planet. We got the best fucking midfielder in Declan Rice. We got the best AM attacking midfielder in the world in Odegaard. Oh, he's so good. He's better than De Bruyne. Arr. Yeah, cool. Okay, okay, cool. So LB said, "Well, so are you going to win seven out of seven then?" But nobody expects it, guys. Look at Klopp. <laughs> Look at him. But. Nobody expects it, okay? Because nobody expects it doesn't mean you can't do it. But nobody expected Liverpool to be joint top. No, they're not joint top. They're second. The league ends now. They come second. But nobody expected. Pundits, nobody in the media gave us a chance. Okay, cool. How does that stop you winning it? Did that stop Leicester winning it? Oh, it didn't, did it? And this is the thing, corners to Liverpool, one minute of stoppage time to go. And this is the thing, bro, yeah? Right? Just because nobody expected it doesn't mean you can't do it. Doesn't mean you can't do it. Hey, Rance Devance is a troll, doing it for Klopp, la. <laughs> a big up Rance. Leverkusen 2 nil. nah. But this is the thing, yeah? Just because nobody expected it, doesn't mean you can't go on and win it. But what happens is this fan base, yeah, they hype up everyone to be the greatest player in that position in the league. But then you say to him, cool. So LB said earlier to Rory Talks Retard, right? He said, cool, so Arsenal should win the league from here. And if they don't, it's a failure then. Well, no, because, you know, we're up against Pep, up against Klopp and, you know, Liverpool, joined, and nobody expects us to, like, go on, I beg you win that. So, okay, cool. So why are you gassing up that we've got the best players and the best in every position? But then when it comes down to crunch, are we going to win the last seven games then? Because if Arsenal don't, and they're in the driving seat, if Arsenal win every game, it don't matter what Man City and Liverpool do. Yeah, so if we don't, is it failure? And this is what these fans do, yeah? They think they're smart, but I, I see through their pukaria, mierda, yeah? They're, they're shit, yeah. I see through it. They gas up all our players. 
Saka's the best right winger in the world. There's not a better right. Shut up, man. Do me a favour. Yeah, Pedro Neto is clear, bruv. Yeah, Mares is still clear. There's loads of players on the right wing better than him. Yeah, let's just be real with it. Right? But at the same time, they gas up all of our individual players. They gas up the manager. Make out we're a massive football club, which we are. But they give it like, oh, we're elite. It's like we've been winning stuff for the last 10 years. And then you go, cool. So if you don't win anything, then, oh, no, but we're up against Klopp. We're up against Pep. Up against Klopp, up against Pep. Yeah, but you've just said that we've got better players than them because he's the best DM. Bryce is better than Rodri, apparently. Odegaard's better than De Bruyne. Saka's better than fucking Foden. Yeah, like so on and so. Centre backs are better than everyone. So now win something then. Oh, but it's the first season back in the Champions League. You know, it was always going to be tough against Bayern. Well, why were you lot shoehorning eight players in a combined 11 then? No, it, bro. But the reason they do it is they don't want to pin their flag to the mast, yeah? And say, yes, we're definitely, we should win it now. We're top of the league. We should win it and it would be deemed failure if we don't. Because they're sexually attracted to Mikel Arteta. These motherfuckers, yeah, have probably never seen us win a league title, bruv. I've seen us win five. And let me tell you right now, I'll be shocked if we win it this season. And if he wins it, fair play to him. Yeah, I'll be the first to accept, yo, for four and a half years, yeah, I've been on his case. I've been giving him dog's abuse on here every day. Well, not on here, but on the other channel. Fair play. He's proved me wrong. And I, well done. I'm super happy. But if he don't, sack him. If you don't win anything, sack him. Four years without a trophy. Hey, they're doing the fucking Liverpool fucking versus West Brom one. Wee! They're all holding hands. Wee! <laughs> Atalanta are mugging it, bruv. They're mugging it. Big up Southpaw, bro. What happened to Hussam? Uh, uh, Lee, what just happened? Hussam lost it. <laughs> so did Liverpool, my guy. Come on, big up to you, my bro. 800 people in this. Smash these likes up. Io de puta. Come on, guys. Get these likes up, man. Stream with minerals was elite. But let's have it right. Chef Badge. Yeah, come on, my brother. Yeah, couple of sus, my guy. Come on, what we saying? Yeah, what we saying? Come on, my Romanian G's in the building, bruv. Always. My missus is still in Romania, bruv. Nearly three weeks. I'm free, bruv. Big up to you, my guy. Big up video complete, Sofian, as well. Wow. But I predicted a final Liverpool level cruise, and I think everyone did. I, I actually thought Liverpool would spank this lot tonight. And now I see the starting 11, I see Gakpu in the team. They were taking selfies on the pitch. Look how fucking shameless they are. Look. It's only the first leg, lads. Calm down. Calm down, lads. This could be used as ammunition for the second leg. But yeah, I predicted that final as well, if I'm honest. But football isn't played on paper, guys. Not played on paper, guys. What's Flowers put his title as? Let's have a look at Flowers. Let's have a little look, guys. The football Terence. Make sure you sub to Terence. Arsenal title to lose. Ruben Amarin. Even put the little thing above the U, proper hipster. To Liverpool, done. Is he signed? Let's Google it. Amarim to Liverpool. He denies agreement between the. Why is he saying it's signed? I don't get it, guys. He said Ruben Amarin to Liverpool, done with a tick. Seems odd. Liverpool destroyed. <laughs> By levity, he's actually spelled by a wrong. I know he's dyslexic and that, but it's hell come on. <laughs> B Y A E R, Leverkusen. That's because he was rushing. Liverpool destroyed. <laughs> I fucking love the internet. It's funny as fuck. Funny as fuck, guys. All right, big up Ted for his tour's doing well in it. 42 unbeaten, you know what I'm saying? 
is what it is, guys. It is what it is. Leverkusen have 33 shots. Wow. Klopp, you are nothing. You're a fool. Good night. Final time in Benfica. Bosh. Is that where is the final? It's in uh, Dublin, isn't it? Yeah, I think it's Dublin, isn't it? Because they were worried about Rangers and Liverpool getting there. But yeah, crazy. Actually crazy. People disrespect the other European. Bro! Worst by, by, by Munich team ever, apparently. But apparently VAR robbed us. You know what I'm saying? Apparently they robbed us. Yeah, they cheated us and robbed us. Mad. Big up for the super chat, my guy. Big up, Ash, man. Liverpool cheated and robbed an amazing, fantastic, since late and now biting battle between two powerhouses of European football. <laughs> <laughs> Atlanta are the best shit team I've ever seen. <laughs> yeah, the Prem's always in the mud because it's pace and power. That's what I keep telling people. How many world-class players are there in the Premier League? How many? Bernardo Silva's world-class. After that, I'm struggling. After that, I'm struggling. Bernardo Silva. Foden's borderline. One more season like this, I'd say he's world-class. Atalanta are a scary, dangerous, since late. I thought Liverpool were terrifying. What happened? Rodri's world-class. Yeah, fair play. Rodri is world-class. Yeah, I thought Liverpool were terrifying. It was only last week Liverpool were terrifying, guys. What happened? My boy Trossard's always world-class. You know what I'm saying? My boy Trossard is always world-class, bro. Don't this my baller. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, these, these guys will understand one day that pace and power will never win. I said, Colin Morris. He's got to be one of the worst strikers I've ever seen. Mentality monster. Part of the game, isn't it? Allison's world class. Salah ain't. Not for me. KDB. You'd probably put him in that bracket, to be fair. Yeah, he would. I like KDB, but the fall off is mad. Although he has had a big injury. The De, De Bruyne Allison. De Bruyne, Allison, Rodri, and Bernardo. After that, where are we going, guys? Because I'm kind of struggling. Van Dyke. Van Dyke, I'll say. Yeah, well bet. Come on. <laughs> Van Dyke's world class. Yeah, Van Dyke's definitely world class. Johnny, Johnny Stones. I don't think he's world class, bruv. I can't lie. He's very good, though. Thiago Silva used to be. Not anymore. Sterling. Nah, bruv. Come on. He's always been shit. Other than that, I'm I'm struggling. That's what I'm saying. Son's nowhere near, bruv. That guy's shit. Yeah, that guy is a purple patch player. Real talk. So limited, man. Ghost game. He's very similar to Salah. He'll ghost a game and then he'll score a tap-in or a penalty. Gundo plays for Barca, bro. Hey, <laughs> man, come with a Romanian G. Dragushin, bruv. Dragushin. No chance, bruv. Somebody needs to get the shears, the garden shears, and chop that top knot off. Yeah, 2008 in call. They want their top knot back. <laughs> and Liverpool losing 3-0 because they weren't very good, mate. They weren't very good. Trent's not world class. Neither's Reese James. Neither's Saka. Gakpo's dead. Paul Koncheski. <laughs> world class Romero in that. Mm -mm. Yo, who's live that we can redirect to? Just having a meltdown. Let's have a look at these scouts. Maybe Anfield Agenda. Big up my boy Craig, man. Where's my boy Anfield Agenda? Is he live? He'll be having a proper meltdown. Big up Craig, man. Craig's a real one. Love Craig. Yep, he's got 7.1k watching his live match reaction as we speak, guys. Uh, so make sure you go and spam Craig's chat. I'm going to redirect to Craig. Big up to everyone who's locked in as well. This stream has been jokes, man. I can't lie. This stream has been proper funny. Uh, I will be back again tomorrow. Um, probably about... 4 p.m. 
UK time. Um, probably press conference reaction straight on with Rance afterwards. And then uh, Betis versus Celta. We will be there, guys. So, yeah, I'm going to have a nice lay-in. I'm going to pick the kid up from school. What is this doing? Is it fucking done the redirect or what? Right, for all the people that haven't subscribed to the other channel or don't know that we're called the rats. <laughs> yeah. The rat army. Uh, because anyone who wanted our tetra out was a rat, apparently. Um, so, yeah, if you get to Craig's chat and he starts giving it about rats and that, don't get offended, lads. <laughs> yeah. And also, Craig's chat might block you if you spam rat emojis. Yeah, so be warned. <laughs> yeah. I've had to tell him before. I right, have listen, big up to everyone who's tuned in, man. Yeah, you lot of class. Honestly, world class. Um, we're, do we're doing it for Connor. We're doing it for Lee Connor. Yeah, what a fucking lad, la. Yeah, we're doing it for Gunner. It means more for Gunner, la. <laughs> Yo, big up Lenny, man. Oh, hey, Craig's a real one, bruv. Yeah, Craig is a real one. I love Craig, man. Proper, genuine, nice guy, man. Uh, but I'm going to take these off because my nose with the imprints, I'm going to turn all the lights off. I'm going to sit in darkness. Hello, darkness, my old friend. For the next hour. Uh, have a wonderful evening. Big up to all of you. Hey, Jason McAteer. Reached the UEFA Cup Winners' Cup semi-final with Liverpool. Nobody gives a shit, bro. What did you win? Nada. Uh, we're out. Spam Craig's chat, Lee Raid. Yeah, big up to all of you lot, man. We're out of here. Love, always. I'll see you tomorrow, guys. Mwah.